Honour killings, pupil excluded from a school in Coventry, poppies burned in London, what do these have in common? Islam. That's enough for you, George, and as for freedom of speech, you've obviously not heard of that. Well, I have actually allowed the leader of the EDL and one, two, three of his supporters on the national radio. That sounds like pretty magnanimous. Um, from me, Thomason, or whatever his real name is, made an absolute fool of himself on national radio. George Tommy Robinson completely wiped the floor with you. It was embarrassing to hear you try and change the subject. I bet this doesn't get read out, says Eddie. Uh, Tim says, I support the EDL fully. I'm a disabled 54-year-old who does not follow football, smoke, drink, or cause criminal acts. If you took the time to research the truth, you'd find the UAF, MDL, don't know who MDL are, cause all the trouble at demos. I've seen the truth. Well, that's not what the police say, Tim. I uh, told you what the police said this week, that the hateful extremism of the EDL is actually fueling a problem between communities in this country and fueling the very Islamic extremism, Sikh, that they say they exist to combat.